This is a 3x4 LED array in a frosted glass capsule lighting up my front porch running at about a half, a little, maybe three quarters of a watt. And uh, I'm going to, that's the house, and here's the actual capsule. It's causing the, uh, the there you go, you can see it pretty well there. And uh, so now I'm going to zoom back over to the chair here and it'll come in as the compensator kicks in and I'm gonna go run and jump in the movie so you can see me and so really and truly there's definitely enough light coming off that capsule now this is the other candle that I normally use this is probably about it the candle itself absorbs quite a bit of the light and the candle itself has just a simple half watt LED in it and a jewel thief that matches it and uh, so it's a uh, 0.5 volt to 5 volt jewel thief amp and uh, the actual device here I'll try and spin around and uh, let you see how that is but actually you can see that it's quite uh, useful amount of light coming off this thing and it'll run like this for four days to a week depending upon how you set it up but uh, it uses about uh, the last test I did in four or five days I used around a half an ounce of aluminum it's an aluminum rod and it uh, goes from a quarter inch down to an eighth of an inch in an area about Oh, six inches or so. Now I'm gonna whip around and look at the capsule and um, it'll compensate and now I'm gonna pop the top off the capsule and show you what's under there. And I don't know if that flare will erase everything but there's the grid of LEDs there and it uh, without the diffuser they kind of waste their energy on the ceiling when I put the diffuser back in place you can see it works quite nicely now I'll be coming up with a comparison of that and it's probably like about a meh, it would be 15 to 25 watt bulb and again the efficiency is in the fact that this the LED is emitting a limited number of wavelengths of light and almost no infrared. A candle, this is like about six candles. The room is lit up about six times as bright as a full moon, you know, this porch. And uh, you can see that the uh, porch is relatively well lit up. But... Um, the table there. Uh, this is a heavily compensated video camera for candlelight photography and so it's kind of the it kind of matches the human eye. It's actually a little brighter than it would actually appear but then it's not it, it's kind of smoother in your eye whereas it's got this bright halo effect over here. You don't get that with your eye. The eye is a perfect sort of it has doesn't have that flaring effect. I don't see that flare and, the, and everything is quite nice. So that's it.